Jessica, another big win for Edmonton today. How do you think your team played? Um, I think our team played pretty good. Like We really stepped up our game just so we were prepared for the semis and finals. So we picked it up and showed what we're made of out here. So you contributed a hat trick to tonight's score. How did that come together? Um, well, just simple plays and passing, just staying to our systems, and it just happened easily. Would you be able to go through each goal for me? I think so. Um, the first goal, I, someone just wrapped it around, and I got a quick backdoor backhand to start it off. And then second goal was off a rebound and another pass. Okay, and then my third goal was a nice pass from my linemate, Ali, and backdoor once again. What do you think uh, going into the uh, semifinal round tomorrow uh, with such a big win will mean to the Edmonton Thunder? Um, it's just going to make us more excited and more pumped up because with this win, we're, we went undefeated in round robin, so we're going to be good for tomorrow and be excited about it. Barry, a 10-1 win over the Kings County Kings today. How do you think your team played overall? Uh, we definitely played better um, than we have all week. We kind of worked on some things, got our our uh, cycle going, worked down low offensively. The offense came to us finally. We've been struggling all week with that. So it was just nice to kind of get going as we're heading into playoffs here. How do you think having a big win moving into uh, semifinals will help the Thunder? Um, I think it'll help them immensely. Uh, they're an offensive team. We've also played well defensively. So just to get that jump going right into semis tomorrow will be great no matter who we face. And uh, a lot of goals were scored, a lot of contributors to the scoreboard. How, how is that coming together? Like, tell me about your team clicking on the ice. Our team is great offensively, and that's everyone included. Um, we don't have one huge dominant line. Um, showed today that one line was a little more dominant than the other. But uh, our team generates lots of offense through our, all lines. So it's good to get them going, and we're looking forward to the next couple days. Hannah, how has your experience been this week at the SO Cup? Oh, it's been amazing. Like, I couldn't have asked for a better team to come here with. The opponents are great, very sportsmanship, and just awesome. So the results haven't showed on the scoreboard for your team this week. Um, how do you think your team has done here overall? I think, we, I think we've done great. Like, our work ethic was there. That's all their coach wanted was our work. Um, the teams here are very tough. They're good, great teams, so... We gave it our all, and that's all we could ask for. Jill, this was your final game of the SO Cup. How do you think your team did this week? Oh, I think they did well. They deserved every bit of credit. They worked hard. They deserve to be here. I mean, five straight in the Provincials, five straight in the Atlantics. And they earned their place, so I'm proud of them. How do you think today's game against the Ed Edmonton Thunder went? Uh, the results were not exactly where we wanted them. The work ethic was there. We had our chances. They don't quit. They... They did, they did everybody proud. Atlanta, Canada, they were great representatives. And uh, on behalf of myself, all the coaching staff, we would like to thank Prince Edward Island, Atlanta, Canada, but especially Kings County. They've been behind us 100% supporting us from home. The text messages, the phone calls, Facebook, they've been behind us. So we owe them a big thank you. We wouldn't be here without them.